Hey y'all, welcome to B's Intuition. I'm B and I'm back with another video. This is a what's happening, what's up video. So basically, um, we're just gonna see what's what's going on in the energy. Uh, your energy, uh, your person's energy, uh, whoever's energy, you know, comes out. We're just gonna see what's, what's, what's happening, what's up with it. I do cuss and I do tell the truth. So if you don't like either one of the two, then you probably should move on. Spirit, I ask that you allow me to channel the messages that you have for myself and the collective. Spirit, if there is any negative energy around me, I ask that you remove it. If there is any black magic or spells coming my way or the collective's way, I ask that you block them. We thank you and we love you. Alright, y'all. Let's see what's happening. Let's see what's up. Hope y'all having a blessed day. Spirit, allow me to be the channel. What's the message? Ace of Pentacles. So we're starting out with abundance, y'all. So that's good. Uh, for some of you, you know, you could uh, be starting your own business. You could be into creating, you know, like, uh, what is this, origami. Or you could be, uh, it is the holiday season, so you could be creating, um, you know, Christmas themed ornaments or something like that. Um, but it's definitely going to bring you, you know, lots of abundance. Ooh. the paranormal curiosity so yeah for some of you um, when it comes to your abundance there is someone in your energy that is uh, definitely curious about it about your abundance and they definitely could be doing black magic and spells um, and there could be, you know, two people that are watching this person and, you know, those two people, they don't look to be into whatever this person is doing. Yeah, they could, they're definitely wishing bad on your abundance. Cards are a mess. They're so thick. And my hands are small. Yeah. Uh, the chariot. A little more spirit. Page of Cups. All right. Here we go. So when it comes to your abundance, uh, for some of you, that uh, somebody's doing black magic and spells um, to stop you from moving forward. For others of you, yeah. Yeah, it is. You're abundant. And there is uh, someone that's... Uh, basically doing black magic and spells to stop your forward movement yeah to stop you from moving forward you're protected though and and you're definitely strong see the butterfly on her shoulder yeah whoever you are you definitely changed your ways um you're very different than whoever this person is that is uh you know curious to 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 do whatever they can to to stop you from moving forward and you're being guided by spirit guides um when it comes to 
these people that are watching this person do this to you, um, they want to apologize pretty much. So there is, uh, you know, someone that is trying to stop your abundance so that you can't move forward. And there is someone that wants to apologize. So this could be two energies or just one energy. Let's see. Yeah. Toil and labor when I picked up the deck and I ain't even, you know, sh shuffled them. So yeah, there is. And toil and labor for me is uh, different than the occupation card. Toil and labor for me is black magic and spells. Spirit wise, Ace of Pentacles here. Main female. Yep, there you are. So, yeah, you're definitely abundant. Um, you're definitely doing your thing. And again, I feel like it has something to do with creating things, creating art. Uh, whoever you are, you could be artsy, you know. Again, you know, you could be creating some things to sell and it's going to bring you, you know, a lot of abundance. The paranormal, why is it here? Privileged lady. All right. So, yeah, this is whoever that's, you know, doing black magic and spells against your money to keep you from, um, you know, moving forward. The chariot. change. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Whoever this is, this whoever this privileged lady is that's doing this black magic and spells, um, there was a change in their circumstances. There could have been an ending to them moving forward from them trying to do the black magic and spells. But let's keep going. Page of Cups. Why is it here? Whew, it flew out. And it's on the floor. And y'all ain't gonna believe <coughs> what it is. And I'm not putting it back. Main male. So the main male uh, definitely could be your divine counterpart. Um... But this privileged lady sees that you're abundant. I don't know if you know this person or not, but they sure do know you. Um, but they see that you're abundant and they try to do black magic and spells against you to change your circumstances and to end something for you. And it could be uh, to end something with your uh, divine counterpart, um, but it also to change your circumstances so that, you know, you can't be abundant. Um, but this main male here they knew about it they watched it and this is who wants to apologize your divine counterpart after they watched this person do whatever it is that they were doing to you yeah and then thief at the bottom of the deck wow to clarify this joint because I see mm -hmm. three of cups it already came out and we're going to take it because it flipped over mm -hmm. yeah we know who who that is Definitely know who that is. Definitely wanted to come out. Definitely want us wanted us to let us know that they're a part third party. Great, awesome. Wow. Trying to keep somebody stuck. Uh Spirit, why is this main male and ace of pentacles here? Judgment. Yep. 
judgment on this third party for trying to do black magic and spells to change your circumstances because there's an ending going on in their life. You're going to continue to move forward. Whoever this main male is, they want to apologize, but let's keep going. Change in the chariot. Five of Wands. Yep. Try to create a conflict in your life. Yeah, to change your circumstances because they're going through some type of ending. And whoever this privileged lady is, they could have been in a committed relationship with this uh, main male. But this main male could be your divine counterpart. And this privileged lady knows it. Um, so, yeah, they were trying to, this third party is under judgment for trying to create conflict, um, competition, drama, everything in your life because of whatever is going on in their life as far as the ending is concerned. Is concerned, yeah. They're trying to, yeah, cause conflict so that you can't move forward. Main male, Page of Cups. Mm. Six of Swords. Yep. Yeah, this main male wants to apologize so that they can move forward with you. But I don't know. I don't know. Well, let's keep going. Why is judgment here, spirit? The empress. There you go again. Because they came against the empress. Because they came against a, a, a earth angel, a, a spiritual being. That's why. Uh, the empress. Yeah. And this definitely is a divine, uh, your divine counterpart. This definitely could be your twin flame. And so this third party is under judgment because they try to come between um, something that God put together himself. Three of Cups. Eight of Cups. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So whoever this privileged lady is, she's doing black magic and spells against you because this uh, main male is uh, walking away, is leaving and possibly coming towards you. And whoever this privileged lady is, she knows it. So that's why she's trying to, you know, cause this conflict, trying to compete with you. Five of Wands. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I feel like, yeah, this this main male was watching, yeah, Seven of Pentacles, analyzing, watching the competition, watching the conflict take place. But they want to, you know, apologize and move forward after they've watched, after they analyzed everything. Um, and maybe they analyzed the fact that it was their fault that they put you in competition or, you know, had you in conflict with this third party. But they know that it's a chance that you're walking away. You're leaving um, the situation, period. Yeah, because you've changed. You're not the same. Yeah. And you're good alone, is what I just heard. So, And this masculine knows it. You're the empress. I mean, and he's, I mean, the emperor hasn't come out yet. So, I mean, if you have to stand alone, you're fine with that. Whoever you are. Six of Swords. Yeah, Ten of Cups. Yep, they want to move forward, um, you know, and, and be a family. Now the one's at the bottom of the deck. Now they want to take action after they watched whoever this privilege, this third party do whatever they were doing to you. Mm -mm. The Empress and the Lovers. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. This third party is under judgment. Strip booty hole naked. But I feel like the the truth is going to be... Re some truth is going to be revealed to you about this third party. Um. But yeah. This third party is under judgment for trying to cause an ending to this divine relationship or divine you know whatever you want to call it hmm. eight of cups six of wands yep 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 and 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 the jet chariot at the bottom of the deck 
the ju the judgment that's uh yeah uh the truth is going to be revealed to this third party and it's going to make them feel like that they've been stabbed in the back a gazillion times and the fact of the matter is whatever judgment they're going through that's their judgment because you're going to have success and victory six of wands with anything that you know you do yeah the chariot at the bottom can't make it up and the fact of the matter is whoever this third party is could be going to jail hmm. seven of pentacles seven of cups yep you get success and victory you're gonna have a lot of options a lot of options many options but I also feel like that um, you're going to have success and victory up against, um, you know, the black magic and spells that this third party tried to do to you. But you are you definitely have a lot of options. And it could be in love. I don't know. I mean, but it's just a lot of different options out here for you that you're going to have success and victory in. Yeah, and this masculine definitely did, has um, analyzed the fact that you definitely could you know have a lot of options in love and that might be why he wants to come and apologize now after he's watched the this person try to take you down try to take you out and I feel like this person has done it over and over and over and over and over again ten of cups mm -hmm. yep five of pentacles Yep, and so this masculine feels like that you do have a lot of options in love and that's why you're leaving them out in the cold. But the fact that the matter is, for some of you, look, it's two people. So he's following or she's fo the third party's following the masculine and the masculine is following the third party. They both still together left out in the cold. So I don't know why this, ma and this is just, this is not for everybody, but for some of you, this masculine, you know, is still... Um, dealing with this this third party so why does it matter if they're being left out in the cold or not ten of swords yeah yeah but regardless of whatever this person whatever this privileged lady this third party try to do you're going to move forward and again I feel like what whatever they tried to do to you um, they tried it too many times and I feel like for some of you, whoever this third party is, they're going to jail. Six of Wands. Ace of Cups. Hmm. So you're definitely going to be moving forward, um, in a new beginning in love and it's definitely going to be successful and victorious. Because, again, you do have uh, many options out here. And uh, at least one of them is, you know, love. Seven of Cups. Knight of Swords. Yeah. And somebody is pissed the hell off. For sure. Somebody is hella mad. Because you have a new beginning in love. You're successful and victorious, and you have a lot of options, regardless of what those options are, and somebody can't take it, and they want to come in swiftly and possibly stop your uh, success and victory, stop your new beginning in love, stop you from moving forward. Five of Pentacles. Queen of Cups. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like it's this masculine that's mad as hell because you have a lot of options and you are full of love. You're beautiful, you know, um, you're intelligent. But whoever this is, I feel like that, you know, you love this person. Um, but you're not drowning in emotions for this person. I feel like that you're worried about your own cup of love for yourself. Yeah, this masculine has realized, has analyzed that you're still on your self-love uh, tour 22. 2022, excuse me. Oh, yeah, but this whoever this masculine is, 
22 yeah the right one uh, they feel like that you are the one but they feel like that you're giving, showing love to other options and leaving them out in the cold five of pentacles mm. yeah they want you to take your guard down seven of wands in reverse they want you to take your guard down yeah can't make it up king of cups at the bottom of the deck <clears throat> the chariot eight of pentacles yeah it could, this could be you know a work situation six of cups at the bottom of the deck so you could work with someone from your past but I feel like spirit is saying that that is the one that you're going to have a new beginning in love with ace of cups but this masculine wants to move forward um, and work on something, but they have nothing to give. They don't. They're not going to reciprocate anything. But then, for others of you, they want you to put your guard down. Somebody wants you. To, this masculine or a masculine or someone wants you to put your guard down, so you guys can work on, uh, you know, maybe a new beginning in love. And they don't want anything from you. Six of Pentacles in reverse. Uh, not a swords. Mm-hmm. But for others of you, I just heard um, this person, somebody wants you to take your guard down because you work a lot and 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 you're not giving to them. You're not, you know, giving to them. Yeah. But I feel like that there is somebody that's in jail that, you know, could be trying to figure out how to work on something with you, but they have nothing to give to you. They're pissed off because they know you've healed four swords and they haven't. And they could be dealing with some type of health issues as well. And I feel like whoever this person is, they didn't give to you. They didn't, you know, reciprocate anything to you in the past. And they feel, you know, like a dumbass. Because you showed them a lot of love. And whoever this is, they know that you have a lot of options. And they can't believe that they messed up with you. They want to come in swiftly to have success and victory with you. But they don't have anything to offer. Five of Pentacles. I mean, excuse me. Seven of Wands. Fell on the floor. Four of Wands, but I'm going to put it back. So, yeah, it's uh, again, we have the privileged lady out here. So, this they could be married or in a committed relationship. But this is also about stability. Um, they feel like you're leaving them out in the cold while you're stable. They want you to take your guard down. Yeah, so uh, there could be some type of union, some type of reunion. Uh, seven of Wands in reverse. Mm. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Yep. Yep. And even if you were to take your guard down, you still don't want to work with this person. Because you're focused on, you know, working, you know, getting your money. And you're not giving anything to this person. And they feel stupid. You don't want to work with this person anymore. Oh, y'all. At the bottom of the deck. Eight of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Page of Swords. And this could, again, be a work situation. And so there could be someone at work that's watching you, spying on you. Could be, you know, a new love. But there's six of pentacles in reverse. They're not, recipro they're not reciprocating. 
something. Six of Pentacles in reverse. Wheel of Fortune. They're, yeah, they're spying, but they're not giving. And they're not giving. Or they they don't want anything from you. But the 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 will is turning in your favor. Because somebody isn't giving, yeah. Somebody isn't reciprocating and the will is turning in your favor and you're on top of it. Whoever that is on the bottom, they look silly as hell. Cause they like, how do I get to the top? You can't. You can't. Yep, they can't believe that they didn't, you know, reciprocate. Mm -mm. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Not a Pentacles in reverse. Yep, yep, yep. They feel stupid as hell because um, they didn't they didn't offer you anything. They didn't you know they didn't reciprocate any of anything that you you know give whether gave whether it was energy time money um advice uh your car uh take it how it resonates they didn't they they didn't give to this situation so this person is getting karma yeah and they know that you don't want to work with them because they don't have anything to offer Three of Pentacles in reverse again. Yeah. King of Wands. They, they don't have nothing to offer but penis. And they're watching mad because you don't want to work with them because they don't have nothing to offer. And you're not going through the same stuff over and over and over again. Period. Yeah. <sighs> Spirit wise judgment here. Bad health. So yeah. Whoever um Whatever they were doing, um, whatever they were doing, uh, it, it it they're under they they're under judgment. I asked why judgment is here, and bad health came out, and so I feel like and that's a thirty one card. So three and one breaks down to a four, and that's spiritual protection, spirit guides. Um, I feel like that uh, this third party was definitely trying to do black magic and spells on your health as well. Yeah, because if you look at the judgment card, you know, that looks like a like a hospital sign or something like that. And you see Spirit has it like it's a baby. So I feel like that, yeah, Spirit had you protected this whole time from this person, but they did try to cause some type of bad health. Why is uh, Five of Wands here, Spirit? Yeah, false person. Yep. Yep. And the, the fact of the matter is, mm -hmm, the masculine is on here too. So yeah, this masculine watched everything. Uh, Who's mad? Why is the Knight of Swords here, Spirit? Why are they mad? Ah, because it didn't work and it backfired it didn't work and it backfired and they're in despair because they don't have shit trying to take your shit yeah why is this ace of cups here <coughs> spirit don't try to fuck with me you came over here so marriage wow 
Wow, so you definitely do have a new beginning in love. And this person definitely is in despair because they could possibly know that, yeah, you have a new beginning in love. And it's going to be successful. It's going to be victorious. And you're going to be married. Five of Pentacles. Rise right here. Journey. Yep. Yep. Whoever this is. They feel left out in the cold because, yeah, you're on your spiritual journey and you don't have a problem with going on your own. Your bags are packed and you are, you are getting, 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 and then you have these people back here that's watching you. It's always somebody watching you. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? And I feel like whoever this is that's in despair, they contemplated, you know, uh, going on their own spiritual journey. But they scared. They scared. Yeah. Will of Fortune with occupation. Mm -hmm. And then we have the Eight of Pentacles. So, yeah, you're definitely going to reap some type of abundance because um, of your hard work. Why is King of Wands here? gift so there could be someone that wants to you know give you a gift this masculine energy I don't know but we're gonna clarify these that just came out so why is bad health here spirit nine of swords yeah they were trying to mess with your mental health that's what they were trying to do empress but how you gonna mess with an empress's mental health and and for that it, it yeah it definitely got them all messed up again nine of swords is you know could be you know lock up lock up the Howard Finn at the bottom of the deck mm -hmm. false person why is that why is this here king of swords wow masculine really really let's do one more false person king of swords Eight of Wands. Wow. Death at the bottom of the deck. So mask so come on, masculine. What you want to apologize for? You right at the end of the day, you standing right there with her. You just trying to act look inconspicuous, but you the one with the freaking mask on. Then you come out, you know what I'm saying? And you want to project, you know, some some death on who? On who? I know not the Empress. And then look at the car. He just sitting in a a pool of blood. Like who who who's a man is this? Who's a man's is this? Uh, mm -mm. Marriage, why is it here? The star Aquarius energy. So both of you, whoever you're going to have a new love, beginning in love with, you both could be, you know, an Aquarius. Or you both could be, you know, in the spotlight, or you both are just um, you know, spiritual beings. But the thing is, you all both are going to pour into each other. But whoever you're, whoever this is, you they know who you are. I don't know if you know who they are, but they look at you like you are the everything. They saw you naked and everything. They don't, you know, and they could have, you know, a lot of options in love, but they, you're the biggest star in their eye. Despair. Yeah, they're in despair because some truth of some truth. Ace of Swords. Ah, Ten of Wands. Yeah. Some truth that they try to that they try to hide behind. Mm-hmm. That only cause burdens for them. They scared. Whoever this is, they scared. Could be scared to come out of the closet. Scared to, I don't know. <laughs> Journey, why is this here, Spirit? Ace of Wands. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they know that you're going to get a new beginning. And for some of you, this masculine, even though he's with this false person being false with a mask on, he wants to communicate about, you know, moving forward on this, on this journey with a new beginning. Occupation, why is it here? Two of Swords. Mm 
Yeah. Yeah. But they didn't put in the work to have this new beginning. So spirit blocked this person. Yeah, because th this person is blind to the truth. They don't. They don't. They don't want the truth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like whoever this is, they de they definitely have headaches. They definitely could be having stomach problems. I feel like this person sweats when they get nervous. If y'all look at this four of swords card. If you look in the armpits, it looks, you know, like it's sweaty pits. Yeah, whoever this is, they scared. Why is this gift here, spirit? The fool. <sighs> Temperance at the bottom. So this could be your new love, you know, and it could be, you know, a gift from spirit that, you know, and spirit is telling you to take a leap of faith. Your dog is too. Your dog likes whoever this is. So again, you know who this person is, but that could be a gift. The fool from spirit. Six of cups, someone from your past. Mm -hmm. I mean, they could be different from you. You know what I mean? But I feel like this person definitely does want to take a leap of faith towards you. And it, oh man, Nine of Pentacles. So either they see you as the Nine of Pentacles, ooh, and King of Pentacles. Mm. They see you, you know, for who you are, independent, hardworking lady, or they want to come and take your money. Six of Cups. I, come on, man. Come on, man. Seven of Swords. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. But for some of you, this masculine is uh, knows that you're a gift from 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 spirit, and um, he does want to take a leap of faith towards you. But this 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 third party from his past is 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 definitely. Um, trying to do some deceitful stuff, but again, spirit is black, blocking this person. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, privileged lady. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Yeah, Tower. Yep, but the plan failed. Your plan failed, lady. Now they just are man. Now they just waiting and watching to see what's gonna happen to you. To you. But guess what? You told him to bring it on. Look. Bring it on. And you spoke some truth. Yeah. Bring it on, bitch. Because you're not this strong. Woo. You're not as strong as me. Mm-hmm. And then here goes the page of cups again. For the secrets and the illusions. Yeah. To come against your stability. Or to come against, you know, your marriage or stability. Yeah. Queen of Wands to the King of Wands. What's this tower spirit? Ten of Pentacles and the Hierophant. Mm -hmm. Yep. Whatever this person try to do, sneaky stuff. Uh, to come up against your money, yeah, they definitely probably are in jail. Justice, I cannot make it up, y'all. Whoever this is, whoever this third party is, yeah, you're going to get some news about some type of evidence that uh, somebody was withholding. It, you already knew it, though, the high priestess. You already knew it. Yeah, nine of pentacles. Mm-hmm. King of pentacles. Yeah. Three of swords, two of wands. Yeah, no. Yeah. Whoever this is, they definitely, you know, were trying to do some things to do some things to do some things but it didn't work it didn't work so we're going to clear our canvas real quick so that um, we can get the outcome of this situation because I mean this masculine that didn't you know reciprocate anything and they don't plan on doing it 
wants a new beginning with you. And then they have this third party lurking around trying to destroy you because this masculine still wants to be in the devil energy, toxic energy. So I don't believe this third party cares about that. I feel like this third party only cares that this masculine is to, to be with them, pretty much. Regardless of whatever way this masculine is. So, but we're going to keep these privileged lady main female change in uh, main male out here. They two toxic people together. For sure. Thoughts and gifts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They could have wrote you a letter. Because of the toil and labor, you're definitely going to get some type of sudden wealth. So, uh, what else do we need to, know, need to know about this main female, privileged lady, change, and main male spirit? Official person. Yeah, so, I mean, when it comes to you, this privileged lady was trying to change your circumstances by ending uh, whatever you had with, uh, with this main male. But there's an official person that uh, basically is in the middle of it. And you're going to get some type of unexpected income because this these people try to end you. Or for a literal death. Thoughts. Wealthy man. Concern. Spirit, uh, why is the main female here? What do we need to know? What's the outcome? What do we need to know? What else do we need to know? Yep, bad mental health or physical health. Yep, trying to do black magic and spells, this privileged lady, so that you could have bad mental health or physical health. Privileged lady, what do we need to know? Out with the old and in with the new. Change. Yeah, this masculine is definitely lying to keep you. They're not ending anything and they're not changing. Main male. Yeah, they're false. Not ready, not prepared. Unexpected. Official person. False allegations, false charges. Bam. So yeah, um, there's something something that happened. Um, and these people wrote your name all over it dealing with false allegations and false charges to get some unexpected income because of a death unexpected income yeah third party three or more people third party mm -hmm. coffin 
yeah, they did black magic and spells. Yeah. Divine Feminine, yeah. They try to injure. They try to say that you had an involvement. Um, they falsely try to accuse you. Well, yeah, they told uh, 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 this official person that you had something to do with an ending, a, a, a death, a literal death, Divine Feminine. This third party was expecting unexpected income from this death, but they said that you had something to do with it. Thoughts? Yeah. This masculine is thinking how, yeah, he's low vibing and how he needs to surrender to spirit. Wealthy man. But I feel like that this masculine um, is also thinking about the third party and how they're keeping uh, him stuck in a low vibing situation. Wealthy man. Nine, nine, nine. It's a wrap. Concern. Yeah, they're concerned that you're relentless and unbreakable and there is nothing that they can do to stop you. Mm -hmm. What's the outcome of the main female in this bad mental health or physical health spirit? Divorce, separation, or breakup. So, yeah. Um, they try to cause, you know, you bad health, bad mental health or physical health, but it backfired. Um, evidently these people were, yeah, because you have the privileged lady and the wealthy man. The the main male and the wealthy man are the same person, but I feel, but this main male is your divine counterpart. But privileged lady, wealthy man, that is the king and queen of pentacles in the tarot. So for them trying to do whatever they were trying to do to you. Um, caused the tower to come down on their little relationship, on their little marriage. So these false people are going through a divorce, a separation, or breakup, and they're having bad mental health or physical health. Yeah, yeah, thank you, Spirit, for playing games. Privileged lady, out with the old, in with the new. Outcome, please. But yeah, as far as for uh, as far as you're concerned, um, I feel like that you definitely separated yourself from this masculine energy because of some type of because you got some type of news that uh, you know they were doing this black magic and spells could have been a, a message from spirit, but we have family is involved, so um, yeah. Remember when the paranormal card came out and it was three people. Two people looked scared as hell that this third party was doing whatever they were doing. Change, lying to keep you. Yeah, good news is coming. It's stuck, cool card, so I put it back. Yeah. 888, balance. Mm -hmm. And and this masculine is, is not ready or not prepared for you to be balanced because guess what? It's over. Main male, not ready, not prepared. Yeah, money coming from court situation. Yep, spirit is about to create some type of balance for you. You're about to get some type of money from whatever these people try to say that you did, that you didn't do. You're going to get uh, good karma from it. You're going, your justice is going to be served um, because they tried to put you in this this situation. And and you're not gonna be you're not gonna be ready. It's gonna create a balance in your life that you've probably didn't hasn't haven't uh you know experienced yet. Official person, false allegations, false charges. Yep, feminine energy. Yeah, you Unexpected income, third party. Bad physical health. It was stuck, so I put it back. And it fell on the floor. Yep, this third party. While they were trying to lie on you and stuff, 
And they was focused on the wrong things because this official person, and they automatically knew that these people were, yeah. again, on the bottom of the deck, playing games. <laughs> With a divine feminine. Come on. Come on. Coffin, divine feminine. Yep, I told y'all. Sweaty pits. Can't make it up. Yeah, now they're nervous because they know they lied. They know they messed up. They know they messed up. They know they messed up. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Thoughts, low vibing. Yeah. Just one, please, spirit. Thank you. Yep. Free at last. So I feel like that you're free at last from this, this situation. And I feel like the spirit is getting ready to create some type of balance for you. And you're going to be getting some type of um, income from this situation. Um, you are free at last from the codependent, attached, obsessed energy. You're free at last of the um, playing of the games. You're free at last from them trying to put you in bad mental health because you could possibly be a single parent and, you know, you don't have time for that. You got to take care of your kids and stuff. Wealthy man, 999, it's a wrap. Yep, because you're seeing through the fog definitely seeing through the fog or they're seeing through the fog that you're relentless and unbreakable concern and relentless and unbreakable mm -hmm. good news is coming and they're concerned communication some type of communication. Phone, text, email, DM. Ooh. Yeah. Someone's trying to going to try to communicate with you um, because they are concerned that they couldn't break you. So they're concerned because you're going to get some good news about this money from this court situation. But they're, they want to communicate with you to try to disrupt your energy. They could be gossiping and lying about you and things of that nature. Yeah. Jail, prison, mental hospital. Mm -hmm. Yep, whoever this is, they're definitely in jail. And they could be, you know, having bad physical health. Put one on the jail before we go. Just one, please, spirit. Yep. They're just trying to blackmail you. They're just trying to set you up. Whoever this is in jail that's trying to uh, disrupt your energy. Give me one more, Spirit. Yep. Whoever this is, they're de they definitely have addictions. Drugs, alcohol, gambling. Proceed with caution, Spirit says. So, for some of y'all, y'all don't need to answer the phone. Yeah, because this person is going through karma. This person is going through judgment. I don't know who this person is. Yeah, because they binded themselves to a spell. I don't know who this is. It could be the masculine or it could be, uh, you know, the, the third party. But whatever it is, um, you don't want to get, you know, even give your energy to um, this situation. This person, whatever this is. Because they're going through karma. They're going through judgment. And you don't want to be uh, dwelling in their uh, their karma. Can we get one outcome, Spirit? Just one. Yeah, running from karma. And yeah, Spirit says you need to walk away and move forward. Do not entertain this, whatever this is. Do not entertain it. Because these people are going to continue to run from karma and run to you because you are the light to, the, to whoever this is or to whoever these people are. Um... But yeah, you're going to be, you know, 
receiving some type of good news about uh, these people, you know, trying to disrupt your energy. And these people are going to jail because they try to blackmail you and set you up. Yeah, they try to say that you, you know, had addictions to drugs, alcohol, gambling. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, y'all, continue to protect your energy. Continue to, you know, do what you're doing because it's working. These people mad, scared, angry, depressed, uh, just all type of stuff because they can't figure out how, you know, to end you. The problem is they're not going against you. They're going against God. So, uh, and I'm pretty sure that they, I mean, they should know it. If they know you, then they should know that you only, you know, do what, what, what spirit tells you to do. You, you operate off of, you know, spirit. So, um, whether these people believe it or not, you know, believe in, you know, spirit or not, uh, Spirit, I just heard uh, Spirit is going to make him a believer today. He going to make him a believer today. Because if you're a single parent, why would this masculine want to... Bro, let me get up out of here, y'all. That's all I got for you guys. I hope it resonated. If it did, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys soon.